Every year, nearly 800,000 people in the United States suffer a stroke. It's a leading cause of serious long-term disability, but therapy can help. In Health Watch, Shelley Bota tells us how the Stroke Support Group at Aurora Bay Care Medical Center is helping victims deal with the after effects of stroke. The Stroke Support Group is taking part in the Unmasking Brain Injury Project. It gives survivors of stroke and other traumatic brain injuries a chance to voice their desire for dignity and respect. Kathy Jaden is painting her mask to tell her stroke story. I've been thinking about how I could show people visually what goes on in my brain. Five years ago, Kathy and her husband were vacationing when... I lost my vision and I really couldn't articulate what was going on. Kathy was rushed to a clinic. They diagnosed me with a stroke. The stroke left her with some difficulties with reading comprehension and memory. It's easier for me to now say when I'm having trouble finding words and I'm in a social setting with many people and my words won't flow. Kathy joined the Stroke Support Group at Aurora Bay Care Medical Center two and a half years ago, which meets once a month for survivors, caregivers, and family. It does give them an opportunity to work through some of their um, everyday struggles, and it gives them a chance to talk about resources that they might not know about. It is my touch base with the reality that I've had a stroke and what I need to do and the support I get from the wonderful people. The group is taking part in an international campaign called Unmasking Brain Injury Project that promotes brain injury awareness. So using art, different colors and different textures is a good way for them to express how they are feeling and things they might be dealing with. Each survivor decorates their mask and writes a background to show their hidden feelings. You know, is it anger? Is it fear? Is it happiness? The masks were displayed in the hospital lobby to share their message with others. And I think it's a great way for the conversation to get started about stroke awareness, stroke signs and symptoms. I hope that gives them an understanding of what what the after effects of a stroke, stroke can be. With the help of the support group, Kathy is enjoying her new normal. But we've got a shared experience that is a bond. And so it's, it's kind of my monthly cheers. The masks the group decorated are now on their way to be part of a national exhibit. To learn more, you can call Aurora Bay Care or email healthwatch at aurorabaycare.com. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelley Botot, Local 5 News.